Hey everybody, it's Shadow John 77 John for short. Last time on Okami, we got here and we're getting ready to fight this guy. This time, we're gonna fight him. Good. And he is just like the um, other guys where he can't be hit from the front. If I remember right, he can't be hit from the front at all. Oh, there he is. While he's doing that, dang it. I can't remember what this guy's name is, but it was something weird. Ow. Hey, hole. He still can't be hit. If I remember right, he's extremely weak to fire. Maybe not. It burned him. Ah. Ooh. Power Slash. He is very weak to Power Slash. Power Slash! There we go. Now we got rid of his mask. Now he's screwed. Wow. I think... Is there any better weapon on this? Um, I think it Rosaries. He's really weak to Rosaries. Why don't you try your rosary then? Because I'm getting the blade of Kusanagi a good amount of screen time. Uh, he's dead, isn't he? Try wind. I don't think we have his floral finisher anyway. He was dead. Oh, what do you mean I did? Uh, I did bad. Uh, all right, fine. Anyway, we get up here to Yoshpet, and the door is open now. So let's go into Yoshpet. Uh, if only I had a better screenplay or a better video editing software. It'd be so much easier. Yes, he ended up paying me money for once. Kai said she'd be waiting for us here. I wonder where she is. Uh oh, look who it is. Hmm? Why a Matarasu? Bah, not that half big profit again. Oh. What are you looking for now, Mashari? I'm still looking for you know what. But this cold sure is making it difficult. Like, we really care, pretty boy. If you're going to be dogging our tracks like this, you better tell us who you really are. Who I really am? That's right. I mean, we already know that you're up to no good. Excuse me, but I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just looking for a certain path. You could say I'm a seeker of the eternal heavens. Aha! Now I know where I keep paddling on about a path to the heavens. You're planning a wolf murder, then you take Ami's place in heaven. What? <laughs> By that look, I take you a nail on the head. That also explains why you keep turning up wherever we go. Path to the heavens? Bah! More like a highway to you know where. <laughs> you misunderstand me, my little bouncing friend. The path to the heavens I seek is not a vulgar thing such as that. My path to the heavens slumbers here in the land of Kamui. I seek a heavenly ark. Heavenly ark? I was riding Kamui, but the ship is of iron, locked in ice. I can set it now, it's almost within my grasp. You know this too, Amaterasu. Leave Furball out of this. Well, I must bid you adieu. No need for prophecies this time. Au revoir. Urgh. Here's Kai. I've been waiting for you, Amaterasu. Did you know that Yoshpet means consuming forest? It's said that those who lose their way in here never escape. Even the monsters try to avoid the place as much as they can. Our tribe has been entrusted with protecting this forest. That's why the entrance is sealed with the Oina Crest. Recently, however, the forest's power has been waking. So blah, 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 blah. Okay. There is a whole ton of treasure in this place. And by a ton, I mean more than you could ever wish for. But there is a price. You have a time limit as getting in through here. So, it's kind of annoying. But, there's another problem. There are trees everywhere. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Trees. I, I remember that. His house when I did this. Yeah, I remember time. that. I remember that. That was, was that was a fun time. Of course, my house has that huge projector, so... Yeah. That helped okay, a lot. I would recommend cutting down as many trees as you can. Or not cutting them down. Blooming, blooming as many trees as you can because they are everywhere and collect as much time as you can. Two reasons why you want to do this. One is because later it makes getting a stray bead a ton easier. I'm not going to be getting it, but it gets you a ton of praise, a ton of food, and it's just overall a good idea. Bloom. 
You're getting better at blooming. Yeah. If you've seen my front, like first few videos, you know. But P Kai <laughs> is completely useless. Almost. All you do is just follow where the trees are. And then just... When you come to a sign or a fork in the path, just go whichever way the arrow is pointing. The thing will tell you where to go. You don't need Kai. Ow, ow. I got double tapped. Run. There is a ton of stuff you can do here. In such a short little time. But, like I said before, we are going to be cutting most of this. So I'll show exactly everything that ha- I'll tell you what all I did and all that stuff, but I didn't- I'm probably not gonna go grab any stray beads or anything. Oh, one more thing though. When you do come to a fork in the road, you usually actually want to go the wrong way if you want all the treasure that's in this place. Dude, that thing was like a cannon. It threw straight at me. And by the way, stopping time with the Celestial Brush doesn't stop the timer. So, I'd recommend grabbing as many of those as possible as you see. I don't care about the Holy Bonus. Okay, go through there. Alright, at this point I think we're going to go ahead and cut it, so... No, 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 don't. You don't have to do anything with that. We'll just record it and I'll cut the video, like, through the editing, because I need to get better yeah. at editing. So, we'll see you guys in a little bit. If we find some funny spots in our commentary, we'll just put them in the video and see how much time we have. Mark the time, though. It was at, like, seven minutes. Okay. So, we just need to know where we are and how much time we use. Oh, in this area, avoid the falling ice. It's not fun. Avoid the shadows, basically. Yeah. Like always, avoid shadows. <laughs> Woo, almost got it. Mm. I hate this game. I love this game. I'm not talking about this game, I'm talking about Monopoly. Ow. Oops. Fail. Afraid of nothing from you fools. Woo! No, he collected a hundred dollars. Any properties? Nope. I 
kidding me? This dude has like the luckiest luck of anything. Ow, that hurt a lot. Okay. So we cut this at seven minutes, right? Yeah. Like seven something. Die in a fire. I almost got hit again. Oh, I'm gonna get nailed. And I save myself. That is how I roll. Get wrecked, game. Oh, wow, and the game decides to tell me to get wrecked. You got ranked. I'm assuming you don't like that that little ice cube, do you? No, I don't. What's the time at the video on? Oh, it was like at 11 minutes, I think. Really? Or 12 minutes? Wow, we're actually done. I don't know. We might. Hey, everybody, we're back. Never mind. We are not gonna cut the video because there's really no point to it. We actually did that pretty fast. We did that a lot faster than I thought we would. Even, but it was slower than it should have been, but still. Bottom line, this is Yoshifet's little secret. This is Punk Tan, home of the Ponkus. Is Ponkus? Ponkles. Isun's home. Ugh. Anyway, Kimu sends Liko's presence here, right? If you don't find her before the day of darkness begins, blah blah blah, Kamui will freeze, people will die, and people are counting on us. What do you do for them? That was a dumb idea, counting on us. Great, now we're out of feed bags for deer, which are in this area. We got a ton of praise. We're just gonna get more of it. Yeah, if you ever ooh, thanks. if you want practice for like Bloom or Power Slash, Yosh Pet, place to go. Rabbits can't feed them. Jeez, this thing is so, like, obsessed with screwing me over. This place has changed a bit. I mean, the Ponka Village, Punk Tan, is a tree stump. Too bad you're so big. I mean, I'm sure you'd like to go in there with the, with the locals, but... No, it's the hammer! I don't like this place. I don't like Punk Tan. It's not... It's just not as fun. Hey, isn't that... Yeah, that's the Lucky Mallet. What's it still doing here? Tell me you don't want to repay... <laughs> don't tell me it wants to repay you for your kindness. Yep, it's exactly what it wants. Who toils can be so loyal? I guess you could visit Punk Tan if you were smaller. Well, for all, you're gonna go in or what? Wanna enter Punk Tan? Yeah, sure. Really? Well, I suppose you could ask the villagers about Lika, but you have to go in there by yourself. I ain't going in there. This sick helmet of mine could probably get ruined in a such a gloomy place. Your bug. <laughs> Boing. Boing. We just got hammered! And that's what happens when you get hammered. Alright, so, with that we go into Punk Tan. And I think with that we're gonna end things off here. So, next time on Okami we will be exploring Punk Tan. Till then, Shadowjohn77, John for short. Bye.